approaching. Uh, luckily, the firefighters are there. They're nearby. They're watching the situation cl uh, clearly and closely. But uh, again, it bears repeating, the 60 freeway shut down right now. And that's in, in having traffic from moving. And as a result, they're having a hard time trying to figure out how to get everybody out and perhaps getting the proper vehicles there to get people out. Um, Hopefully they'll get this situation under control, but obviously Lefty, we're going to have her watch this uh, very closely. Lefty, uh, by the way, you were by another area right down the road where you were watching, you showed that video of those hand crews putting out those fires. Has the situation rolled through there? Is that better, uh, is, is that situation better in that particular place because you were in a great deal of danger at that time? Um. In, in, in terms of it burning itself out, yes, it appears to have gotten better, but there is a lot of resources down in that area right now as that fire has burned because there is a lot of brush against this hillside. And like I said, the freeway is a full stop because there is a concern that the fire could jump to the other side. There is another hill right there, and it is also just as dry as the other one, so they've moved a lot of resources. So I still believe that the firefight is intense over there, especially in this hillside. I mean, if they, can you turn the camera and just show the thick black of the smoke you can see the smoke here getting really heavy because this fire is moving closer and closer down to here and that's why they're now staging uh, brush protection here you can see there's a brush truck with cal fire that is now coming closer to us so we were a little bit away from it but it's come a little closer now as they're moving their resources uh closer into this area we're starting to see those really hot uh the, the gray big thick ashes coming in and we can hear the helicopters that are doing the drops over this area. Now, I do want to mention, I did forget to mention that with the evacuation in progress, there is a care center that has been set up at Patriot High School in Harupa Valley. Again, the evacuation center for these people is going to be at Patriot High School. So we do see another uh, ladder truck coming into the area as well. So they're definitely moving resources into this area because the fire is getting much closer. The smoke has gotten a lot thicker. I mean, the fire is now burned down to the hillside where we can't see the flames anymore because it's gotten lower. So right now we're just, again, waiting to see when this evacuation will start to take place because the smoke is wafting pretty thickly into this area. But most of the firefight for now is still up in the hillside and just right over here off to the side where you see a lot of those brush trucks staging. Okay, 